What's up, my fellow YouTubers and those of you who are guests on YouTube? But uh, I wish I could have showed you my tremendous backing skills that I developed over the years. <laughs> I had the back in this off the street, you know, into the drive, and then inside this building that I'm in. It's a car out there that was a couple cars kind of noise. So you gotta just pull up, back up, pull up, back up, pull up, back up. And you got impatient drivers on the side that don't want to wait for you to go by. You know, wait for you to finish what you're doing. You're doing. I gotta get past, hurry up, truck, hurry up. That's how people be. You know, truck drivers wear nuisance to the, 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 the public, the general public that's just driving. We're doing work, they gotta get to work, or gotta get home to the store. And we're blocking the street, and this uh, gets on their nerves. Listen here, I want to tell everybody this here. When you see a truck backing into a dock off of the street, or backing into a lot off the street, whatever the case may be, be patient. Have some patience, you know. Don't be so in a hurry to get to, you know. I gotta go, you know. He make a one move, and then you up try to squeeze by. You could potentially uh, end up dead, basically, you know, on the tires, you know. You know, you, a lot of times people pass, truck drivers can't, we already, when we start backing up, the coast is clear, you know, we look back, we made our check, sometimes get out and look, if you know, I like I, I get out and look, if I don't know what's behind me, I get out and look. With the flatbed trailer I have, I can see back there, but it got this bulkhead in the front, so if I turn a little bit, then I can see. But with a, a full uh, trailer, a van trailer is what they call it, can't, uh, can't see back there. Forgive me because I keep sniffing. I got dust on my nose. It's kind of dusty in here. It's dusty in the yard, dust blowing the air. Make my nose want to run. It ain't, it ain't start running. <laughs> Hopefully it won't. But dude, you won't see this one. <laughs> but uh, yeah, have some patience for truck drivers. You know. We're doing our job, it's like you gotta do your job. And uh, you know, be patient. Be a little be a little more patience, you know. I understand, don't don't get me wrong. I've been there I've been there before too. You know, I used to be a patient truck driver back in there, taking his time. Like he's just taking his time. Yes. He is just taking his time. And that's what he needs to do, is take his time because as a truck driver, that's your job, that's your career. You don't want any accidents. You don't want to actually back into a car, back into a part of this building, or even just scrape the side of your truck. That's the company's truck. You know, you don't want to damage anything. The truck driver has to take his time when you're backing up. Turn around and go around, you know, another way if you can. You know, if you're just impatient. But try, you need to try and be patient. You know, it's, once you've been doing it for a while, it's not hard, but at the same time, depending on where you're going, depending on the, the amount of room you have to back into uh, a customer's dock or a customer's uh, overhead door, uh, that determines if it's, uh, you know, if you can just back on in, if you just smooth selling or not. You know, like where I had to go today, this was smooth selling. You know, I got in all right, but it wasn't smooth. It wasn't just like, as soon as I started turning out, I, a jacket, 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 turning, and then next thing you know, I'm in, boom. No, I had to do a lot of pull-ups. Pull-ups is going up, then go back a little bit, then readjust, then go back a little bit, then readjust, go back a little bit. I had to do that to get where I'm at. And I'm going to show you why. <laughs> That's the whole truck. See these cars right here? That car's here, that car's here. You know, so it's not straight in. I had to come off the streets, okay? And, uh, you know, it's not, like I said, it wasn't a problem, but it's just not like 
a simple end. <laughs> that's not a simple back end procedure. So I'm, I'm showing you. I'm, I'm taking you through the path that I had to <laughs> go through. See that car right there? That car. It's it, it's not completely in the way, but it wasn't there. It would help a little bit. Okay, so this is the path I had to take. Okay, and then now out on the street. So my truck facing this way. I gotta back up around here. Around here, I gotta keep my eye on that for, out for that car. Make sure I don't go over the curve, tear up their grass so they can charge the company. Make sure I don't hit that pole. Back up. Now see here, you see that? You can't even see the dock right here. So that may have to back and then turn while I'm backing. So understand, understand this is what a truck driver does, you know? So when I'm out on the street right there, and I'm trying to back in, and someone trying to go up past me, you know, cut me off, while I'm backing in, they, I'm already turned, so I'm jacked where, they, where I can't see them. And they try to hurt me, squeeze by. I mean, that's a potential, that's a dangerous situation, you know what I mean? It's dangerous for you more so than for me, you know. But people have the mentality, well, well if you hit me, I'm suing. If you hit me, I'm suing. That's all people think about. That's all right. But what about if you did? Well, then your family going to sue, but you're going to be dead. <laughs> you know, take your time. That's all I'm saying. Have a little patience, a little, you know, exercise a little courteousness, a little kindness in your driving, you know. We all could be better drivers. I must say, I'm a pretty good driver. I'm safe, I'm courteous, but I'm sure there's some things I could work on as well. So, now here's the dock again. Look, this, well, that's why I had to back into it. Look, you can't even see in there. See what I'm talking about? And I had to back in there. So, once again, this is your boy, Melly Mel, freshman truck driver. And, uh, Hope you learn a little bit about truck driving. Hope you ex exercise a little more courteousness and kindness when you're driving. Thank you, and I'm signing off for real this time.